What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. I'm excited to announce that we're gonna have an additional version of VIP Shop Management. It's called VIP Shop Management Pro MSI and the difference is it's a 64-bit. What's the difference between 32 and 64-bit? 32-bit application. First of all, most computers are 64-bit. 64-bit means that your CPU is 64-bit. Obviously, it's double the size of the 32-bit, right? So when you have an application that is 32-bit, trying to run on a 64-bit computer it uses an emulator so there it's an additional step but the emulator is so good that you wouldn't even notice however it's not the same as running 64-bit directly basically a 64-bit app will directly communicate with the cpu versus this 32-bit app it has to go through an emulator and then connect to the cpu so it's an additional step which will make it just a little bit slower but it's not just that vip shop management has been growing and we need to have more memory just for the app itself so if your if your computer doesn't have much memories it's limited to only like whatever the memory you have half of the memory you have with a 64-bit uh, it has unlimited memory so you can use all the resources to run um the only thing that you need okay so what's the difference is there any downgrade yes there's one thing that does not run on 64 bit which is speed dial so if you're using speed dial do not use do not install msi why because uh, vip shop management is 64 bit just keep using the click once application and m uh, and speed dial is 32 bit and you know speed dial they're so slow so i will try to get them to get a 64 bit as of right now speed dial does not work on VIP shop management MSI so if you're using uh, speed dial do not uh, download the 64-bit version we're still in testing process but I'll walk you through it see how it works and uh, if you want to test with us right now you can just go to download right here and under whether local database or cloud doesn't really matter just go to additional downloads and scroll all the way down you're gonna see VIP shop management pro beta version 64-bit we're going to click on download just click on open and uh, it's the installation is a little bit different so it's but it's really simple so it's going to open the installer right click on next 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 and yes if you don't like updates you know you're one of those that don't like updates um, this is perfect for you because VIP shop management and this one does not check for update You still can update but you get to click on help and check for update other than that It's not gonna bother you even if you double click on the app. It's not gonna update. So what happened is gonna install the this is the This VIP shop when I double click on it on the click once applications it checks for updates this one It does not so click on restore and that's it apply settings and you're good to go and this is the 64 bit how do you know this is running on the 64 bit it's really simple go to task manager and go to and you're gonna see vip shop management right there if you don't see 32 bit next to it that you see how it says 32 bit that means this is 32 bit when you don't see 32 bit that means it's running directly on 64 bit so so I mean the trend like right there this one's 32 bit so the transition has been um, for a while right now for Microsoft but 64 bit applications are faster they don't need to use the emulator they run directly um, uh, one more thing you will have to install but VIP will promise you to install that if you're using the old chain sticker printer it will promise you to install um, the, the, the driver for that which is fine don't worry about it just when you click, click on print it's going to say hey oh, you need to install the 64 bit but other than that let's just um, create an estimate real quick and this is the cloud version by the way so you're going to see like super fast version of vip shop but even though vip shop is already fast don't get me wrong but let's go to parts tag and right now what the beauty of that is the bra because we do have like our own edge browser inside vip and it's going to be running on 64 bit too which is cool all right so napa submit i mean it's 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 good anyway don't get me wrong it's it, it's fast regardless but like i said so when do i recommend the msi version if you have slow internet and you cannot handle update yes download the msi version if you have a slow computer another thing you can't handle so many updates download the msi version 
But after you download the MSI version, make sure you go ahead and uninstall the other version. So if you go to installed apps, because you, you do not open both of them at the same time. I know you can right now, but do not open at the same time because it creates problems. Go to VIP, search VIP, and this is the MSI version is gonna have a logo next to it. So that's how you done it. If you see anything without logo, just uninstall it because you don't need it anymore. The self checking app pro will have an MSI version, but not right now. There's no need because we don't do many updates on MS uh, on the self checking pro, but eventually it will have an MSI version too. MSI version, like I said, it lives on the computer. Um, the other one, the click once application, it lives on a temporary file. It's a shared folder. Uh, it's a temporary folder. It's a shared folder. So another app can delete that and it makes you install MSI. It will never going to give you the message where it says, connect contact the vendor why because it doesn't check for update so it has a lot of advantages but uh, don't get me wrong click once application will always have the latest update why because click once application we can deploy updates just like that msi will take a more time to deploy so you're gonna have you're gonna have way less updates on uh, on the msi even when you click and help and check for updates because we want everything to be running on the uh, it's a lot easier, like I said, to deploy. But yes, you, you don't have to go through the process of the beta. So in, on the ClickOnce application, we do a lot of updates, sometimes three updates a day. Um, on the, on the MSI, you're going to have probably twice, once every two weeks, once every one month. And you do it manually. You click on help and check for update. So if you guys were interested to check it out, you can. Um, if you're happy where you're at, you're having no issues, there is no need. Remember, MSI cannot run speed dial as of right now because speed dial is not 64-bit. Anyway, appreciate you guys. Until next time, thanks for watching.